Hi guys, welcome back to Shop Customizer video series. I'm Milad and this is video number 5 and we're going to talk about the widget styles. In previous videos, we overviewed the Shop Customizer and then we talked in depth about product list, product page, and checkout and cart pages. If you haven't watched them, I suggest you pause this video, watch them first, and then come back. Now let's talk about the widget styles. With the introduction of Shop Customizer, we've added a feature that allows you to customize the appearance of widgets inside the sidebars. If you remember from the previous videos, you can add sidebars to product list and product pages by going to their settings in Customizer. So here I go to product list settings and assign a left sidebar to this page. The content of this sidebar can be edited by going to WordPress dashboard, appearance, widgets inside these two WooCommerce widget areas. And if you'd like to learn more about the widgets and sidebars in Jupyter, check out this video tutorial. Now you can access the customization of global styles by going to shop, and clicking on styles inside widget styles section. Actually, you can access this dialog from the main customizer panel as well. You just need to click on widgets and then click on the styles button to bring up the same dialog. We've called this global styles because it affects all sidebars on your website. So let's explore them. The title style affects the appearance of each widget's title. The options are similar to what we had in previous videos. So you can easily change the font family and size or the color. The next style is for the boxes. Each widget is inside a container which you can change the background color, adjust the radius, or border size and color. We have adjustable margin and padding options as well. Now I'd like to reset the values inside this boxes style to show you the next style. So I just click on this button and confirm to restore the default values only for this tab. Now let's bring up the styles again and open the divider style. The options are familiar. I just increase the border width and change its color. Let's also increase the top margin. OK, looks good. And we can click on Publish to save the changes for front end. And that's how we can style widgets inside the sidebars. To see newer videos, make sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Have fun and see you soon.